Hey guys, welcome to the workshop. So in today's video, I wanted to share with you kind of a quick tip on this little thing. So stick around. Okay, so this thing is a thin piece of plywood and a piece of wire wrapped around it. This is actually a really neat jig and I've used it many times. What this is going to do is enable you to bend and make an arch. So if you're trying to cut an arch in a piece of wood, you can do it with this jig and I'm going to show you how to do it really quickly, really simply. So to make this jig, you're going to want a couple things. You're going to want a scrap piece of really thin plywood, uh, something that's at least bendable and that's all you really need. And then some picture frame wire. You can also use string or heavy duty string. I just happen to have this laying around so you can use that. But first we're going to want to take our piece of wood and just roughly sketch two little V's, one at each end, and then cut these off, these little V's out using either a coping saw, miter saw, or whatever. I'm going to actually use my little saw here. So all this is doing is giving us a little groove for the wire to sit in and do the same thing on the other side. Next we want to do is take our wire. And uh, this is kind of a mess. I got it actually at a flea market in one of those boxes you buy and you get about 15 different things in it. All right, so you want to have enough of this wire to where we can wrap it around here. Once you got it here, take a screw or whatever and just wrap it around that because all this is going to do is create an anchor point for one of these ends. And with picture frame wire, if you wrap it around itself, it does a pretty good job at holding it together. And we just pull this nice and snug into that corner there. So there we go. So then take the other end, wrap it around one end, go to the other side again. And then that's gonna be about all that we really need. Take some wire cutters and snip it. There you have it, very simple. So here's the idea. So depending on how much of an arch you want, take it on the floor, get this started in the groove. So bend it to where you want it, pull your string nice and taut, go to the other side, and then wrap it on itself. And there you have it. It's an arch that you can use for a template to mark out your design. Okay, so there you have it. It's a really simple, real crude jig. Um, I have this laying on my shelf all the time. This piece of plywood is actually an eighth inch, so it's really, really flexible. And uh, the wire, I did a little bit extra, and it's actually not picture frame. This is actually actual wire, um, and it works out just as good. But I've used it on many different things. I made an archway that went in front of our bathroom at the top to kind of hide the curtain rod, and it turned out really good. And the cool thing about this is when you bend it, that wood is gonna just naturally go to a nice even bend. You're not gonna have one side as bent more than the other just because you're pulling it naturally from both sides. So you don't have to really do a whole lot of math in that. The one thing that you wanna be mindful of is just making sure that what you want the arch to look like. You know, from if you measure from the edge of your board to that line, you know, make sure you have the dimension you want. So this is a really easy jig that you can create, leave it on a shelf, leave it somewhere, or for that matter, you can use it once and then throw it away. It's such a simple thing. But I hope that helps you when you're trying to make an arch, um, just a piece of really thin plywood and some picture wire, and you've got yourself a jig. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Subscribe for more tips and videos just like this one, and be sure to give me a thumbs up on this video. But guys, thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you next time right here in the workshop.